Hello and welcome to this Bitcoin video where I'm going to be talking through the importance of making a trading plan, blocking out all the news, emotions and focusing on the charts. We're going to be specifically talking about Elliott Waves and Fibonacci time. Fibonacci time, one of the most legendary and underrated tools in the whole of trading. I want to just talk you through that um, to start off with here this morning, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we obviously put in our high on the 13th of March at $62,000. So just write, write down these numbers uh, if you're following along. $62,000 is the all-time high, and that was put in on the 13th of March. Okay. You might be thinking, you know, how many times have I said there's never, ever a random pivot on the chart? Every pivot is calculated where we're going to be putting in the highs and lows. And we start to use our Fibonacci time to get the time where the pivots will be put in. And then we start to use our confluences of technical analysis for the price where it will be put in. Okay, So we can just see here $62,000 on the 13th of March was the high. Okay, I'd want to show you a few posts here of Fibonacci time. Uh, you can see this post from me, which says, uh, yes, that Elliott wave count, very important for me. We never broke the NPOC trendline support, so we are still in wave three. The top should be put in on the Fibonacci time pivot band, the 13th to the 14th. Okay. As uh, this guy says, quite crazy on the Champions live stream from the 28th of February, 28 minutes into the video, where I was analyzing the Elliott wave impulses. And uh, here you can see the Fibonacci time pivots uh, where we put in that high on the 13th. I will show you a really quick clip from the uh, Champions live stream two weeks ago, over two weeks ago now, where I was um, talking about this Fibonacci time pivot. If you just want to take a quick listen. We had a major downturn around the one uh, 0 0.618 and the one to one is coming in on the 13th of March that's about two weeks away okay so I was this was during our champions live stream I was going through my whole Elliott wave camp recognizing we were still in wave three for another push up because we never broke our important trend line support and we were looking for the next pivot to be put in on the 13th of March so ladies and gentlemen this is how you start to recognize not only the price where price is going to, but the time. And this is the this is a massively important aspect of trading that I suppose it's fairly complicated. So I mean, it's not that hard, but a lot of people don't look at time. But I feel it's such an important factor because, you know, being able to tell where the market's going is obviously good. Being able to tell the price where it's going is good. But if you, let's say you're trying to look for a short, but you enter your short on the, I don't know, the, the 12th, then you're stopped out on the short before you get the move, for example. But if you're aware of the time where that pivot's going to be put in, I hope you can see how that is such a massive advantage. So, for example, when we were on the 13th and I knew that, you know, today or tomorrow we're going to be putting in the high, um, that is what then gives you that extra layer of confidence to be shorting up, at, you know, above $60,000. Okay. I refer you to this other quick post and this was obviously if you want to go back and watch this video it's around 30 minutes through the video and i was talking through you know the move up that we're going to see on bitcoin and i was saying uh, that was on the 12th so on friday i was talking about why i would not be buying the breakout on bitcoin and how i was looking for the abc flat okay this was in the free public video giving you all of this talking how i wanted to see the abc flat so for the a b come down for the c Okay, this was on Friday the 12th. Then on the 13th, before we actually hit $62,000, but on the 13th, I obviously made this post. Oh, yeah. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. You like that entry? <laughs> yeah, I hope you do like that entry. But uh, yeah, we moved this on. That was obviously 23 hours ago. Let's move it on to the post from the 13th. Obviously, because of the fact... Um, because of the fact uh, it's now the 15th, this is where it's by. But this was the post that I put on the 13th on Instagram. If you're not following on Instagram, yeah. <laughs> hey, you might have missed this. But hey, this, this is what I was saying on the 13th February. Of course, Bitcoin, Bitcoin and all time high, all time high. Uh, we're back above $60,000. Uh, just be careful of the ABC flat. You heard it here first. Yeah, you heard it here first. ABC flat. And there, after the video on Friday, talking about how I wanted to see the ABC fat, flat, well, then on Saturday, I was doing that, well, you sort of just saw the video there on Instagram of saying, be careful of that ABC flat. You heard it here first, ladies and gentlemen, you heard it here first. Hey, hope you listened, because what did we get? 
well, on Friday, we were talking about what I wanted to see. On Saturday, I was giving the big warning. Well, and, and on, on Monday now, we, uh, we, 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 got, we got it. We got the fake out of the move. We topped out at $62,000 on the 13th. We come back down below the high. We got the massive fake out of the high. Trapped longs, breakout traders. What can we say? Uh, not, not going too well for the breakout traders. And we got the ABC flat. At the very least, we have come back down below the low. OK, so this really emphasizes what have I emphasized in this video? The first thing of making a plan, which is knowing you don't want to trade the breakout of this. Uh, secondly, it's it's having the idea before it even happens that you're going to get the fake out with an ABC flat. It's then not only recognizing an ABC flat, but it's recognizing the exact day two weeks in advance, <laughs> two weeks in advance, recognizing the 13th as an important Fibonacci time pivot. Then not only recognizing all that, but then also, yeah, the high was $62,000. Yeah, the, the, the short entry there, $61,998.84. Um, ladies and gentlemen, what, what can I say about it? Um, I, I, I wanted to upload this video partly for my for my own ego and satisfaction because I feel this is this could go in the world record book. This could go in the world record books. <laughs> We've seen over a 10% move from the high. That's probably the best short entry you're going to see in the whole world period because that is literally literally the all-time high. I truly don't believe there's nobody in the world with a better entry than that. Um I had three entries I could share these with you. Um and yeah that it's period impossible to have had a better entry than me that was off of three three market short entries by the way um but yeah not not to uh, let my ego explode too much although it's very hard to control it <laughs> but yeah but ladies and gentlemen what could i say uh gave you the idea free on friday i emphasized it on saturday with my warning on uh yeah warning that we were on the 13th of march looking for that abc flat heard it here first well and hey what happens here monday we come down I was putting $62,000. I had my short from basically $62,000. Uh, not only calling the exact high of the move, not only calling the ABC flat, not only calling the fake out of the move, and then uh, also calling in advance <laughs> the exact day that it's going to happen, which was the 13th of March. Um, yeah, what can I say? Called that day two weeks ago and also shorted the all-time high to the dollar. Uh, the value that I've offered in this video, although this video is, is partly for my own satisfaction to uh, put this on YouTube, not going to lie, I love it, I love it. Um, <laughs> so, 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 anyway, uh, yeah, apart from my own ego, this video, um, I also wanted to just really put this on here to show you the value and the importance of Fibonacci time, ladies and gentlemen, Fibonacci time. I mean, if you want to learn about Fibonacci time, we obviously have the whole module on the website about Fibonacci. Oh, this is Cloudflare that we have. <laughs> this is just people on the website. Uh, yeah, if you want to learn about Fibonacci, then obviously we have the Fibonacci module on the website where you can learn about Fibonacci time, retracements, etc., etc. Uh, it's So it's, yeah, importance of Fibonacci time importance of having a plan, importance of knowing what you want to do with that plan. And at the end of the day, um, trade the charts. That's all I can say, trade the charts. Um, as I've said many times, the, the charts don't lie to you. You also had a perfect CCV setup last night, by the way. <laughs> so yeah, what can I say? Uh, lo lo lots of setups, lots of opportunities. And um, yeah, hope you've enjoyed this. Hopefully a very eye-opening video of how it's, how it's totally possible to be ultra accurate like ultra accurate and just remember that if we look on the weekly chart you look at the, the high on the weekly this is uh, obviously the all-time high sixty two thousand dollars you know so hey what can i say <laughs> short of the absolute all-time high on bitcoin on the day it was going to happen two weeks in advance that's going in the world record book uh even if we break up from here now hey i'm, I'm content i'm very happy <laughs> so um hey i hope you're, you're happy too and uh, you're ready to absolutely crush the charts once again opportunities every single day bitcoin is an absolute gold mine when it respects the technicals like this also oh, perfectly thank you ever so much everybody and uh yeah, let's, let's see how this Elliott Wave count progresses. Very, very, very content with it thus far. Thank you ever so much and have a brilliant, brilliant day of trading. And uh, cheers, everybody. Thank you and goodbye. <laughs>